Martin Freeman stars in Cargo, a Netflix original movie that's basically Cormac McCarthy's The Road, just with slightly more hope. In a post-contagion outbreak Australia, Martin Freeman is on a trek to rescue or save his infant daughter and to get her to safety. Along the way, he encounters others, some meaning harm, some not so much. It truly is just like Cormac McCarthy's The Road, except it just has a little bit more hope in it. Not everybody that he meets is out for themselves and out to do him and or his daughter harm. I love Martin Freeman. I love him in just about everything he's done. Even The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which most people hate, I love him in that. But I think he was overshadowed a little bit by just the foreboding and the sense of misery and just destruction or despair that is coming with this story. Like I said, there is a little bit of hope in this, and Martin Freeman's character actually encounters some people who genuinely want to help. They are some nice, caring people. So that's really a good spot, a bright spot within Cargo, because like I said, the road is just abysmal and dark and depressing and ugh. And so this one, while it shares a lot of that with it, it has that tiny bit just of bright. The film itself is fairly quiet. There's not a lot of dialogue. What that means then is that we're relying on the characters themselves to convey their emotions through their eyes, through their facial expressions, through their body language, all of this. For me, Cargo is just kind of okay. It's not fairly memorable, and I'm sure within a couple weeks, I'm really not going to remember watching it. Like I said, I love Martin Freeman. I wish this would have been a better vehicle for him. There's no sex or nudity, some profanity, and a fair amount of violence. I give Cargo three out of five couches. Have you seen it? What did you think? Share your comments below. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to hit that like button. Also, share, subscribe. I'm Chris. This is Movies and Munchies. Thanks for couching with me. <laughs>